Hello guys on YouTube, how are you guys today? I am doing uh, pretty good uh, myself today, but I got a unboxing for you guys today about this small portable uh, travel uh, key uh, lock safe where you can put your uh, wallet, your phone, uh, your iPod, all sorts of stuff, you know, like something like that, important kind of thing, your cell phone, or you know, your iPod, you know, that kind of stuff. But if you want to keep everything safe, this is a very good size uh, little safe. Now, of course, the one thing uh, you cannot put in it is a gun because it's not actual considered a gun safe. It's actually recommend it on the package itself. But it's kind of interesting. Yeah, it's a very uh, heavy duty uh, made out of a metal uh, construction and it's a pretty nice uh, decent size uh, case. Now, typically if you're going on vacation or if you're going on to work or wherever you want to go and you want to lock up your invaluable kind of stuff, like I said, your phone, your wallet, or your iPod, or your keys and money, or whatever you want to put inside of this little safe. You can do that. It also has this little strap and uh, some keys and other thing else. But let's uh, look around here on the box here. You guys can see. Hey, you guys can see. It does not say a gun safe. You cannot put a gun in this little metal box. It's kind of interesting. And we got our own uh, stuff here. You know, it's just a safe. And we got some things on the front of the side of this box. It says it's a car, boat, or luggage travel kind of thing. But it is so kind of unique at the same time. This is a good mini size safe to actually keep half of your uh, important kind of things uh, safe. That's why it's called a safe. But I don't know, I just picked it up down at my Oli store. You know, in the originally price it was, you know, uh, $20, but I paid less than 7 bucks and 99 cents for it. But, uh, I don't know, I guess this was just the last kind of thing he actually originally had down at uh, Oli's itself. But I don't know how well this is actually going to really hold up uh, to whatever abuse you put this uh, case to itself. But it is very kind of slick and kind of neat. Yeah, very interesting uh, box here. It's a very uh, unique box and it's always so. Here's the name if you want to know what the name is and everything on it. Let's go ahead and uh, open up this little box up and find out what's very uh, interesting of uh, what's a value in this uh, case <laughs> box itself. But it's just cardboard, you know. Cardboard box typically with any packaging, but I really mostly want to know what's actual on the inside of the box itself. But you guys can see, there is the safe itself. It is well packaged, well uh, sealed and everything. But you know how everything is when it comes packaged. And I was like, yeah, okay. Sometimes you actually have to tell the plaques to pulp. But uh, this is not a uh, Wall of Truth uh, box at all here, guys. Uh, it's just kind of a okay destruction. You know, just a standard uh, metal size. And you guys can see, that's about it. And it's not really that uh, nice on the inside of this case. But it's really nice on the inside, I think. But, uh, you know, for 7 bucks, you know, you can't beat that price of paying for a little bit of security but like I said you know once you use it and you figure it out it's just you know it's just a safe here guys you know this is a small little guy and we got your little tether rope uh, you can uh, tie this down to uh, your boat or your luggage inside your packaging or your car or whatever you want to call it and we got some keys of course that's kind of nice to have and you also got your instruction manual uh, for it as well, but hey, you know if you know how to use a safe you really don't need the instructions But I would recommend uh, actually using your instructions and looking up the safe itself It's a matte uh, black uh, sprayed on paint finish now, of course, it's not really <laughs> Not really a uh, good safe uh, at all here guys. It's just a safe I bought but for the structure of the way it's actually built 
I don't think it's a very safe type of safe to actually use for all sorts of different things, but I think it'd be kind of cool to actually uh, see what you can use. Now, again, it's uh, a limited to a very small space on the inside of the case. Now, if I want, uh, I can put my wallet, or any uh, iPod, or even my phone inside of here, but remember of the space uh, because it's a very small safe, but it's kind of interesting to uh, put your some different items you want to keep safe inside of this uh, little uh, safe. Now, of course, uh, do you want to actually lock it on you? Because you can't actually get the keys out of it if the actual uh, lock. No, so it's kind of a okay safe, but I think it's kind of neat. It's kind of interesting. It's kind of a very, uh, very interesting kind of packaging to actual uh, buy. But yeah, you know, you just get your standard two door uh, little keys, and you can just plug it. You know, plug it in here. Doesn't matter which way it goes. And you can actually lock your safe, you know. But how screw really this thing can be, and I don't think it can be that so screw, guys. I think anybody can um, break into this type of cheap little <laughs> safe. If you had a like, actual a nicer safe, like a stronger, uh, heavier uh, safe, that would uh, be kind of uh, unique and nice. Now, let's go ahead and I'm going to pretend I'm going to lock my uh, wallet in there. And also my iPod, and this was something to be kind of cool for lugging around, uh, you know, for vacation. And you also put the uh, keys, one of your keys, on your keyring, and also you got two keys. You got spill keys and other thing else. But I think it's kind of cool. We do got a little hole over on the side for the actual little uh, wire uh, to go on. Hey you guys can see. But, you know, I, I don't know. I just think it's not a very good style safe. If you're on a very good safe, I'd recommend spending uh, extra money on a whole house kind of safe. But this is just a travel uh, style uh, safe. But, yeah, it's not designed for a car. It's also designed for, uh, you know, own stuff. You know, traveling uh, purposes. And that's what's kind of very uh, nice and unique about it. Now, let's talk about... Uh, the box itself, and let's talk about the uh, way this uh, is designed to go in your car and your boat itself. Well, let's move that off to the side. I put it kind of in the background for you guys can take a look at. But that's what it's designed for. It's designed for your car or your boat or your luggage as well. Definitely, if you want to carry your important type of uh, data with you, or even hard drives, or whatever you want to put inside of it, you can put whatever you want to put inside this little um, metal uh, tin here. Now, if I was actual, uh, if I really wanted to mount this, uh, I would actually just drill the back of it and mount it with screws, instead of using uh, this actual rivet uh, kind of uh, thing here, you know, uh, strap down uh, thing. That's about it. I don't know why you include it, but you include it for you can strap it into your luggage, your boat, or your car. But I don't know. Let's take a look. Uh, let's take more look at this thing. See if we can pull this, uh, you know, plastic uh, housing out here and see what uh, how it's really constructed and how it's really made. But yeah, it's just you know, like I said. It's just a metal case. And like I said, you even put the instructions on the inside of here. It says not a gun uh, case or anything like that. And you can actually pull this uh, little plastic material out, uh, the sleeving material out of it. And you can actually maybe get a little bit more room inside of this uh, little case itself. But it's kind of interesting. It's kind of an interesting buy for me because typically I don't buy uh, cheap things like this. But hey, you know what? Yeah, they won't sell. But it's just metal. You know, that's about it. That's all this is. Um, not a, it's good quality made, I think. But it's not that good like most on uh, safe safes, you know, real safes out there. This is actually really... Uh, uh, it's not a expensive type of item. It's like about 
18 bucks, you know, whatever you decide to buy, you know, it's like, okay, try it out. And you got this little guy. I'm gonna go ahead and actually pop this open and take a look at the actual cable itself. Now, the cable is actually a steel cable. You guys can see it's just a small steel cable. You only have one uh, rivet heel for you can tie this to your call and you can put this on the inside of your call. Now that's typically about it. And you got your instructions. And of course, you got your two extra keys. You got a spell key in case that you lose one. And that's about it. Alright guys, if you are going into this channel, please hit that subscribe button, leave a comment down below, please like, please show, peace out, bye guys, we'll hopefully see you in the next vlog.